ACR and we've got Mark Flanagan online all the way from the United States. Good morning, Mark. Good morning, mate. Oh, it's not a nice time here, but yeah, good morning. <laughs> Sorry, mate, I always uh, stuff that up. Uh, how's the preparations going for the big WBA uh, world title fight in France? Yeah, no, the uh, preparation's been going good. You know, we've um, just knocked out a few good sessions over here in Philadelphia. Got some, um, some hard sparring tomorrow, and then, uh, yeah, everything's looking on the track. We've got some good sparring partners lined up here, and, uh, yeah, things are looking real good. So you're getting plenty of sparring in in Philadelphia before you make the trip to uh, France, is that correct? Yeah, yeah, we're looking at getting about 50 to 50 rounds of sparring in the next two weeks uh, before I go over to France. And um, obviously, um, this week my last sparring, I won't be sparring in France, so all, all my last sparring was all going to be here in Philadelphia. Yeah, who, who, um, who, who you got? Me, so that, that's great. Who have you got lined up for sparring there in Philadelphia? Uh, we've got Steve Cunningham, former world titleist. Oh, yeah. Um, Good. He's in his world, he's in his world. If you know boxing, you know Steve Cunningham, you know. Yeah, um, sure do. We've also got Sonny Conto. He's the number one um, super heavyweight uh, amateur in America. Mm -hmm. He's about six foot four, so he's a good fighter. And we've also got um, uh, Garrett Wilson. Garrett Wilson is uh, he's a bit of a... He's done about uh, 40 something personal fights. You know, he's been around the block you want so you find yourself fighting for the uh, WBA uh, cruiserweight title again on the 20th of October you had a crack at it, it was over a year ago now uh, Dennis against Dennis Lebedev when you you lost on points unanimous decision for that same title wasn't it Mark, um, well you got the experience now, you were over there a year ago overseas fighting for the title, now you've got the experience mate, you're going to do it this time aren't you? Yeah, this time, this, this, this fight's definitely more suited to me, you know, um, I'm getting, getting a bit of sparring with the fight, I didn't get much sparring for the Lebedev fight, and the sparring I did get was the complete opposite to what I needed. Um, this fight, yeah, it's good for me, you know, he, he comes in and he fights hard, he, he, I'm going to try and walk me down. I'm not going to have to look for him. I'm going to meet him in the middle. It's going to be a good fight. Uh, and the fight I'm getting here is going to be good preparation for that kind of fight. Yeah, oh, that's great, mate. Well, all we can do is wish you all the best, mate, and bring back the bacon. Oh, thanks, mate. I really appreciate it. Thanks for coming on Radio 2 BACR, Mark. Much appreciated, mate. All good, mate. Anytime. Thanks, Mark. And that was Mark Flanagan. What a great guy he is. He's, uh, he's pumped. He's ready to go. He's fighting on the 20th of October in France for the interim WBA World Cruiserweight title. He's taken on Arsene Golomirian in France. He's 23-0. And this time Mark Flan Flanagan's going to do it. We're going to go to a break.